Hi everybody, welcome back to the shop. We're here at Speedway Motors. My name's Tim, and I'm always so thankful when you can stop by and we can talk about stuff that I get excited about. And if you know anything about me, you know that subject is old school, traditional, hot rods and custom, stuff that my forefathers would have built. I just love this stuff. And I brought one of my favorite pieces with me, and it's sitting next to me here, and that's the 1951 to 1956 Cadillac and Oldsmobile style air cleaner. A lot of folks call it the Batwing air cleaner. And if you've been in the old car business for a while, you know these things are pretty sought after. If you find an original one, they're getting really tough to find, so you should count yourself as pretty lucky. A lot, a lot of the prices I've seen on these old air cleaners anymore are, you know, three to four hundred dollars. Of course, then you get them home, they're set up to be an oil bath air cleaner, which, you know, there's no problem with that, but a lot of folks nowadays want to use the paper element. The oil bath worked well when we had the old dirt roads and, and uh, times were a little tougher, uh, but nowadays, you know, the paper filters work so much better, a lot of guys want to convert the old original Batwing air cleaners to the, to the paper element. So you have to do that, and a lot of the air cleaners out there, the original ones, you know, some of them have rust issues, surface issues, dings, dents, all that stuff, and you know, it can be a pain, you know, getting those things worked around so they look good on your hot rod. I'm so thankful we live in the day and age that we do because now we can find stuff right out of the box. It's, it makes it so easy, and I brought two versions with me today that I can talk about a little bit as far as the specifics of these. I brought the full size unit. I kind of got it sitting up on its base here, and this is my favorite, and then I brought a 7 8 uh, scaled down version too. What I think most people notice about these when they pull them out of the box and what we get the best feedback on when it comes to these air cleaners is, you know, guys will say, Tim, holy cow, I got that air cleaner. I just love it. I pulled it out of the box. That thing was heavy. And it is. It's really heavy stamping. This is better than the original most likely. And, uh, you know, it's ready to paint out of the box. There's no issues. You know, it's a, just a wonderful piece. One thing I really like about they, these air cleaners too is they've been designed with a little bit of a clearance on the back, so you know it helps you clear any of your distributors, such as you know an HEI type distributor on a Chevy. So you know that's an extra bonus that you know you don't notice it when it's installed on a car, but it makes all the difference when you go to bolt this thing on. They all come with the carb studs and nuts, you know, so that's no problem. And again, all the filters are over the counter stuff, so really easy to come across. I'll kind of put this one down and I'll talk about the, the larger unit, which is my favorite. They're both built exactly the same, really heavy. You'll see the, the base plate on this. They're actually designed with a 5 and 1 eighth inch hole, so that's going to fit all your four barrel stuff, you know, your Hollies, your Quadrajets, your Edelbrock carburetors, uh, which is really handy. But there's a lot of artistic license that you can take with these. I've had guys build their own base plates, had one guy build one for a three deuce setup, and this thing fit just fine. So, again, really nice. I'll kind of show you the inside of this too, and the inside's just as nice as the outside. It's just a really well-built piece. You know, nothing chintzy about this at all. I'm, I'm just in love with it. Really good, good unit. Another piece I'll talk about is something that kind of works for a lot of different air cleaners, not just these, but this is an adapter. A lot of times I get guys that'll, you know, not understand these are for four barrels, and they'll say, Tim, I want to put this on my old Rochester two barrel. Will that work? Sure. You know, you can buy this handy little adapter from us. It's just a little aluminum adapter, and this uh, converts you from the five and eighths inch hole down to a three inch hole. So that'll work on any, any carburetor with a three inch opening. So pretty handy piece. Boy, I wish I would have had this when I was a kid. I went through so many struggles trying to get different air cleaners to fit different motors. It, we, we have it too easy nowadays. We have all these parts right on the shelf ready for you whenever you need them. If you have questions, you know I love answering them. Just give me a call anytime. Give our tech staff a call. We're always happy to help you out. Otherwise, subscribe to our YouTube page. Ask us questions directly on YouTube or here on Facebook and we'll get right back to you. I love talking about these types of parts. You know, this is my forte and we love old school hot rods here at Speedway Motors. So give us a call with any questions questions that you have. We're here to help you. Until the next time, folks, really glad you could stop by and we'll see you again soon.